Today what we're going to be talking about are planes of the human body. The first plane I'm going to be talking about is called the frontal plane. As you've just seen in the picture, the frontal plane runs along the side of the body, separating the body from the front to the back. Exercises that run along the frontal plane include exercises such as the delt fly. Other exercises also include things of the hip such as adduction and abduction. The next plane we're going to be talking about exercise, uh, sorry, is called the sagittal plane. The sagittal plane runs straight down through the middle of the body, separating the body from one half to the other. It doesn't have to sit directly in the middle, it can sit slightly obscured to the side, but it does separate the body from one half to another. Exercises that run along the sagittal plane include exercises such as hip flexion, front raises, lunges moving forward and backwards, also bicep curls and tricep pushdowns. The other plane we're going to be talking about today is called the transverse plane. Exercises that run across the, the transverse plane equals exercises such as the chest press. Other ones also include the rear delt fly. The human body doesn't have to stand upright in order to run across these planes. You could have the body bent over such as doing exercises such as the bent over row. So there are the three main planes in your body. You've got your frontal plane that separates the body from the front to the back. You've got the sagittal plane that separates the body from one half to another. And then you've got the transverse plane that separates the body from the top to the bottom. 